Uh, next we have uh, Leslie Marquin. Good evening. My name is Leslie Marquin. And I'm proud to say that I'm a taxpaying citizen of uh, Los Angeles County, United States of America. And I would like to say that uh, it makes me sick to my stomach to know that uh, I live in a city where cops can kill dogs whenever they feel like it. And um, there's different ways. They could have gone, they could have took a different route to handle that, that situation. And uh, it just breaks my heart to know that cops can just kill a dog. Uh, there's such thing as pepper spray. You know, you could have sprayed Max. And uh, there's different ways of handling situations. I just pick up a gun and shoot the dog. Uh, that's just like if I was walking down the street and a dog just barks at me and then I kill it. What would happen to me if I did that? Probably get life in prison. Probably go to prison for 20 years. But uh, not the officer, because he has a badge, and he's trying to protect the community. And uh, it just doesn't make sense that I'm paying taxes and paying uh, the wage of an officer that can just kill dogs. And uh, I truly believe that the city should take action to train these officers on how to handle situations with animals. Because... Uh, all Max was trying to do is protect his owner. And uh, it just breaks my heart. Um, I just think there's a different way of handling situations like that. And uh, I, I, I just want to say to the council here that you guys should take into consideration that you know, cops go to school to learn psychology and this and that and tactical this, tactical that, and how to shoot a gun and how to spray with mace. And I think uh, Max would be here today if that dog would have took it, if that cop would have took a different route and uh, maybe sprayed him instead of shooting him five, well, five times. You might as well should have just used a grenade or rocket launcher or something, you know? or the baton, but uh, it just makes me sick. You know, I drive around, I go to work, and every time I see a cop, I just, I mean, uh, it makes me nervous because they have all the authority because they carry a badge and they carry a gun and... <laughs> It just doesn't make sense that this officer is still working for the Hawthorne police. And I think action should be taken against him. He should pay a price for that. Because all he did is murder. <laughs> it doesn't make sense. And I was just wanted to be here to express myself and uh, let people know that if you're paying taxes, you're paying their wages, you're paying, you're putting food on their children's table, on their paying their bills, paying everything, not paying them to kill dogs because they feel like it. You know, I, I, I seen what happened and I truly believe that that cop was not in danger at all. You have three officers standing around. The animal's only this big. There's different ways of doing an animal. You don't have to shoot him and kill him. And if we all did that and walked around all day because a dog barked at me or jumped at me, there'd be dead dogs everywhere. But I truly believe that they should learn how to use the mace more instead of a gun and shoot dogs. Because they don't only just shoot dogs, they shoot people too. I've seen it. Just because they have a cell phone in their hand or something. So I, I truly believe that this officer should be fired or he should pay the price or do something to show the community that there's justice for all of us. Thank you.